Hey Grants Pass High School, we're going to be having a card stacking challenge. The of this challenge are quite simple. You can use any type of playing card. No glue or tape can be used. The cards must be holding themselves up. Your card tower may be built on carpet or a table, and most importantly, be creative and have fun. To make the basic card tower, use two cards to create a triangle, and you can use these triangles to create a base. You then add onto the base, and you can use YouTube videos or the examples as a reference. I hope to see all of you participate in this challenge. Email your card towers to Mr. Matthews at amatthews at grantspass.k12.or.us. Hey guys, we have obviously been missing you, but it doesn't mean we've just been standing around doing nothing. We have been planning and putting some stuff into motion, one of which is curbside checkout. So we can now, if you guys let us know what books you want to check out, we will pull them, we'll email you and let you know they're available, and we're going to take them downstairs and you can pick them up anytime, Monday through Friday, 7.30 to 3.30. They'll be there for you to pick up. If you're not sure what you want, um, I created a Canvas page, it's called the GPHS Library uh, Canvas course, and I enrolled everyone, I think, so you should have access to it. And on our landing page there, you've got access to the library catalog, there's a link for that. And if you're not sure what to do in the library catalog, we've created lots of little different instructional videos, so there's a link to the videos too. Link to ebooks and audiobooks, if you still don't know what you want, there's a link to a form where you can tell us a little bit about what you want to be reading, what you've enjoyed in the past. We'll email you with a list of books we think you might like, and if all of that is not enough, there's also a link to our email addresses so you can email us. We will do literally almost anything to get the right books into your hands. So we hope to see you soon. In the meantime, let us know what you want. Hey GP, this Thursday, October the 8th, we're having an at-home movie night where everyone will have the chance to watch The Sandlot from your own homes. Make sure to start your movie at 7 p.m. to follow along with the interactive Instagram stories on the GP Caveman Instagram account. And make sure to wait till the end of the movie for a Kahoot link where you could win a free Dutch Rose gift card. Yes, so leadership's getting the code drive the entire month of October. If you want to come participate, you can bring codes to the front of the high school from 7 to 3, and we'll be accepting all sizes. So come participate. Hope to see you guys there. We have Mrs. Tyrell here. What do you think? Poggers mean? Um, well, that's obviously the game I played in elementary school, um, where you uh, you have to you have to flip the pogs. Oh, I mean that's actually not bad. Uh, <laughs> so it means like when something exciting happens in a game, like so it's actually pretty close. So it makes sense. Yeah, I'm not that old. My name is Jenny Tyrell. I'm advisor for the Pride Club and and Scroll, which is our school newspaper. And both clubs are meeting weekly, virtually, and somewhat in person. Hey guys, so the Pac-12 is going to be playing football this fall. Starting November 6th, they'll be playing a seven-game conference-only season. The MLB playoffs are going on right now. It's the first time they've had 16 teams and are having a bracket. Game 4 of the NBA Finals is tomorrow at 6 o'clock between the Los Angeles Lakers and the Miami Heat. Go to at GP Leadership's Instagram story and give us your predictions. Game 3 of the WNBA Finals is tomorrow. Tune in on ESPN2 to watch.